quadratic equation I would like to consider for you is this one. Solve b squared plus 20b equal 80 and you see the answers down here. And the answers are not just cut and dried, they're decimals indicating that uh, uh, the, the uh, zero point for the quadratic is not exactly on a whole number. So therefore, I'm going to have to put these numbers in as they are after into the, into the formula, into the, into the table, and see how it works out. Now it probably will not be exactly equal to zero, but I think the answer will be real close to zero. So I've got to do the same thing. So coming over here, I'm going to do x squared uh, plus 20x equal 80. Again, I want to subtract 80 from both sides. And that gives me x squared plus 20x minus 80 is equal to zero. Remember again, I gotta have that zero over there. Now I'm gonna take my calculator again. I'm going to type in, or I'm gonna clear it first. Okay, memory's cleared, I wanna to go to table. I wanna put in my equation, x squared plus 20x minus 40. So I put in x squared plus 20x minus 80 and I press enter and then I can also go down my protocol and just press it by, by pressing enter each time but when I get down here I need to go over to ask x to get a open table and then press enter again one two three times and I get an open x okay now I put in my x values I'm gonna go back to my possible answers for that and where are they right here okay here's my equation so I'm gonna put in start with a, ne a negative 7.76 so I'll go to negative 7.76 and press enter and I get a number that is a negative 174.9824 which is not zero or not even close to zero. All right, I'm gonna try next, next, the negative 23.42. So uh, put in negative uh, 23, oh, negative, gotta go back and clear that. Uh, gotta be a negative 23.42, enter. And I get, whoops, that's pretty close to zero. I'm not sure just how close it is. Let's go ahead and try the 3.42, 3.42, enter. And that gives another number pretty small. It's, it's pretty close to zero, but let's try these others to make sure that we're not there. Let's go ahead and do a negative 12.25, enter. And that's a, wow, uh, negative 2799 divided by 16. I don't think that would get it. Okay, let's go down here, get a positive 7.32, and we get enter, and we see that that's 113.9842, therefore it will not be good enough. So we go back to our negative 23.42, which it would be the answer to that solving that equation.